So the challenges definitely for this generation are much different than previous generations. Let's talk about the uh, cybersecurity challenge and how that, uh, the, or the, the video challenge, the cyber in a box school video challenge, and how that is preparing students in your region uh, to face you know, some of the, the things that they're facing in a more educated way. Absolutely. So we challenge, the Cyber in a Box School video challenge started as kind of an idea and a committee that we're on called the Wyoming CAN Committee. And CAN stands for Cybersecurity Action Network. It's 100% volunteer, it's grassroots. And we decided that, and one of the members of the CAN Committee is also the Wyoming State Library. So we decided as IT professionals and you know bank representatives and insurance agents across the state, not everybody was technical, that we wanted to create videos that were understandable, that would demystify some of the terms that you just said, you know, um, that you just said is tech speaks different than, than regular speak. And so we started that. And then we thought, hmm, maybe we should take this and um, get it down into the school level. So we wrote a grant or I, Cyber Wyoming Alliance was charged to write a grant. And we got it through the Rocky Mountain Power Foundation and the Cybersecurity Youth Apprenticeship Initiative. And what we ended up doing was sending out a challenge to middle schools and high schools statewide saying, make a cyber safety video that your grandma would enjoy. Yes. And, and humor was encouraged for sure. That was one of the big things, as you said, make sure it's funny. Um, and and feel free to use topics that maybe your peers have faced as well. I mean, but it's something that maybe we wanted to encourage um, multi-generational. Um, we wanted to encourage discussions at the dinner table. And um, and really that's where cyber safety should be discussed. I mean, we, we discuss financial stability at the dinner table sometimes. We, we discuss physical safety at the dinner table. Um, we should also be discussing cyber safety. So that was the whole point. And each team, because of the grant, got $100. And so some of those were pizza money for video editing sessions, and some bought cameras so that they would have a little bit more, and some paid for you know, copyrighted material or whatever, and, um, or, or maybe editing software. And um, they all got t-shirts as well. I love that, Laura. 